Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm filming a Bai Makari haul. I'm super excited because as you could probably see in the title, I'm actually going to be starting a new collection. So you might be thinking, didn't you just say a few months ago that you were never going to collect anyone again? Yes, I did say that in my NCT Dream collection video. After I finished my Dream collection, I've been keeping random photo cards here and there and I decided that I wanted to pick up collecting this NCT member as well. So you'll see the photo cards come out so i'm not gonna say who it is yet so go ahead and comment down below who you think i'm going to start collecting if you watched our videos for a while you probably know who it is because he's one of my biases so i'm really excited to start collecting him but let's just get started i have a lot of envelopes because like i mentioned it's a lot of photo cards this time and i always say this in every Bai haul but shopping on Bai is so dangerous because makari has a lot of older items since it's like a resale site so i always end up buying things that i never thought i wanted until i see it for a good price and i'm like ah oh, i might as well buy it since i'm going to be combining shipping anyways <laughs> but i will open the biggest package first because i think it's an item my friend purchased i also have another box as well that i don't have in the screen currently because it's a little bit big but it is my 127 special daikon magazine and i will be opening it in this video but i'll show you the box it comes in and i'll upload a separate unboxing to upload later just so i can film a better flip through of it so here's what my friend purchased it's an almost blue crossbody bag i believe i think either chanyeol or seven has used this bag before i'm really not familiar but i know she's wanted this bag for a while and Someone was selling it um, for resale, so she hopped on it since it was a pretty good price. Literally, Makari and Bai are so great because it's all these things you wouldn't expect <laughs> to find on there, but since it's like eBay and it's a resale site, you end up finding a lot of things you weren't originally looking for while you're looking through other things. Dangerous, but very fun. So this is my friend's item as well, so I won't take it out of this wrapping, but it's XOSC's What a Life postcard book. I don't think she intended on buying this either, but it's just something she also saw and was like, might as well buy it since we will be forwarding shipping together. This looks like a photo card, so maybe this will be the first card for the member that I'm starting to collect. Oh no, this is a postcard. I should have just turned it around. But this is the missing headset postcard I was looking for. It's easy to find American sellers selling this as well, but at the time when I was looking, nobody was really selling it. So since I was already buying things with Bai, I decided to just purchase it from a Japanese seller. It's so cute. Reminds me of the elevator acrylic standee I have. Oh! So here's the first photo card for the member I'm collecting. I'm curious to see how many of you actually guessed and got it correct, but the member I'm going to start collecting is Doya. So cute. This is his Awaken photo card. And I'm only planning on collecting his album photo cards. Nothing else. He's so cute. I am not a big fan of they're Japanese PCs because they're usually um, photo shoot pictures, but the Love Holic ones this time are selfies, so I'm really excited to see those. But yes, my first Doyon PC from this haul. I'm so excited to start collecting him, and I'm really excited to eventually store his photo cards away. I'm collecting the cards all together now so I can put them together all at once. And I haven't decided yet whether I want to use a mini collect book, which is like one page each. Since I'm not collecting a lot of his photo cards, there isn't many to store. So I was thinking either a mini collect book or an A6 binder with three, po three photo cards per page. So I'm still deciding between that. Let me know what you guys think. This is his empathy photo card. So cute. With a mark in the background. <laughs> Next, these are my friend's photo cards. So she purchased two Sun SC photo cards from What a Life. I will see if I can open this to show you which other one it is. Oh my god, how funny. <laughs> so it's these two. Yeah, 
we have Diane's chain photo card. I'm also not a big fan of how they put their names on the card. They didn't do it for Awaken, but I know they're doing it again for Loveholic. And I would just prefer if they didn't put the names on it. It's because it blocks a lot of the picture and it's it just doesn't look as nice as like just having the photo, I guess. Next photo card we have Chaniel's Mama photo card for my friend as well. He looks so young. How cute. Next we have, ooh, Doyoung's Neo Zone Kino. So I purchased some Neo Zone Kinos not too long ago and I vlogged it. I actually wanted to pull Mark because I really liked his photo card, but it would have been nice to pull Doyoung too since I decided I wanted to start collecting his photo cards. But it was for a pretty good price on Macari, so. I've been slowly buying his cards for a while now, waiting for this video to mention that I'm going to start collecting it. But I think I've purchased all his cards except obviously his Superhuman Kino because that card is really expensive. But they did announce yesterday that they might restock Kinos now, so hopefully they do and I can get his Superhuman Kino. So this is Chanel's Exploration in Japan photo card. He looks really cute here. Yeah, I was debating for the longest time whether or not I wanted to collect Doyang's album pieces because I was already saving his cards that I, like if I pulled him from Resonance, I kept his cards. So I have basically all his Resonance cards already. But I don't know, I didn't want to just have to like add on another member to have to look for when new albums come out especially because in one to seven i already collect heads on but i don't know something just like changed in my mind and i was like you know what i'll just do it so here is his t version photo card really pretty but yeah i thought about it for a really really long time <laughs> but it feels nice to be collecting all my biases now. Here is his C version, I believe, or maybe N. This is N. The photo is a bit dark on this one, but it's still cute. This is his player two or one photo card from Kyozo, you know? Oh wait, this is from the final round here. Yeah. I think there's actually two of these in here because I helped my friend purchase one as well. She's also a Doyoung collector, but she collects much more thoroughly than I do. Not as much anymore, but her collection is super impressive. Huh. Interesting. I don't know why there's two of these. I think it might be a mistake. Oh, I'm really confused. <laughs> I need to do go double check to see if I purchased two of those or if it was just mistake. I guess we'll see because we're almost at the end and there's supposed to be another one of this card and his other Kino as well. So his empathy PC, this is reality. And then the last one, I guess we'll see what's missing. <laughs> okay, so I'm missing the other card of this. I guess the seller accidentally sent me the wrong card. It's okay. So this Q 
Kino was actually the most difficult to find. For some reason, not a lot of people are selling this. Maybe because the card is really cute. But this Kino was relatively easy to find on Macari. But this one was a lot more difficult. He's really cute in this one, though. But yes, I ended up with <laughs> two Neo Zone Kinos by accident. So here are all the things we purchased in this Baiyi haul. Oh, actually, I forgot to show the Daikon magazine. So here it is. Purchased it off Baiyi as well and just forwarded it with these items since I wasn't ready to ship. I'll be opening that in a separate video so I can show you in more detail. But yeah, this is our haul for this time. Lots of Toyon photo cards. I'm really excited to eventually store them away, so stay tuned for that video. Be sure to subscribe if you're interested in seeing more videos from us. And if you're interested in trying out Makari with Baiyi, be sure to check out our $20 off first purchase link in our description. And if you have any questions about the service, as always, feel free to comment and we'll try our best to answer. But for now, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.